Hey guys, it's no two guy here with another GTA 5 video guys and today in this video we're upgrading the brand new Grotto Turismo Classic that came out earlier today on GTA 5 Online. As you see here, it costs 700k and you quite easily buy it off Legendary Motorsport. So pretty much just get on with this video. We're going to do our typical stuff, we'll be upgrading it, showing you guys all the customization options for it and then we'll do a little test roundabout driving in the city with my first time experience actual driving the vehicle. So guys, front bumper. Okay, well, we'll go with classic. You saw them there. There's not really too many special options. It's just like the other sports classic car that came out last week. So, it's nothing really fancy, to be fair. Nothing too different there, which is a bit upsetting. I thought it would be a bit unique, but nope. Let's see, we've got titanium, wide, so what? Exhausts, fuck it. We'll just go with some chrome. Chrome? Yeah. I'll go with chrome tip. They look pretty good. Now, hood, always an important bit. I love that. I like that guys, I like being able to put a stripe down the middle, it always makes your car look good. Am I going to put one? Probably not, because I've got a kind of colour scheme which you'll see later on. I'll show you all the colours though, so we've got this one with the little scoop, I love that one. That's the one I love, GT, mm. GT hood look lit, look at that, to me that looks like a, what's it, FMJ, oh, it looks beautiful, I like it. What else, we got horn, I never ever put a horn guys, I don't know why, I think it's just a bit of a waste of money and your car sounds good without it. We're not going to put neon yet, I don't know if we will, it's a classic car, it looks nice without it. Okay, respray, here's the important bit guys, colour. Okay, black, it looks pretty good. Yeah, white, it looks interesting in white, I'm not really, hmm. I don't know, I think I want to go with like a reddish colour guys, but I'm still going to show you every colour possible, why not? If you guys are going to be buying this vehicle, you guys need to be able to see what colours look good with it, you know. Right, uh, we've got white, frost white anyway, we've got black, it's okay, what am I doing? <laughs> okay, here we go, right. Silver looks pretty good, that was one of my first thoughts, silver always looks good with a classic car to be honest guys. Red, that's what I was looking for, I want to go with a reddish colour, it looks good, it's grotty, it's Ferrari. So, Ferrari to me symbolizes the color red, which looks good. That's the one I'm going to go with in the end, guy. Lava red. <laughs> it looks beautiful. We've got orange, yellow. Yellow is what I put the lamp with. Yellow is associated with lamp, so not happening. We've got our kind of green shades here. Quite like gasoline green. I like that. It's kind of like a teal color, guys. I've used it before in my Ocelot links. If you guys want to be able to see that video, please leave a like down below, and I'll do a video on all my cars from my office garage if you like. Midnight blue looked good. I know, like, there's some colours in GTA that go with, like, every car, and it's kind of strange. I don't know why, but they do. So, like, it's usually your blues. Usually dark blue. Like, the kind of midnight, darky blue colour. Looks really good with all cars in GTA 5. It's pretty cool. Here we go, we'll go with a lava red. Pearlescence, guys. I don't know, it looks good, pearlescence the way it is. Because it is technically a pearlescent colour. It's red and orange put together. Green, ugh. See, that's, that's what I hate about metallic though, is just that the side mirrors here, I don't know what to call them, the side mirror things, they change colour, or like your secondary colour changes, it's annoying. So you're kind of forced to go with the primary colour, again. Well, I'm, nah, we're fine, let's see, there's nothing really, yeah, we're fine with lava red, it looks good, right, we're on, okay, there's the wing mirror things. Which colour? We'll, we'll just go with red. As I said, you're kind of forced to unless you want your car to look stupid. Trim colour. Oh, guys, we're in the interior. This looks pretty cool. Bit annoying that the steering wheel's in the way of all the dials, but look, you got like a little grotty logo race car. I quite like it. It looks pretty good inside, to be honest. Right, let's go. Right. The crew emblem, never. What's this? Sunstrip. Hmm. Oh, it's the thing that comes down. Okay, so we've got carbon, primary or secondary. To be fair, we'll just go with uh, primary. It just It's cheaper than secondary, so why not? We've got to save some money, guys. Spent 700k on it, so let's see. Skirts, we got, we'll just keep them default. Looks good. Spoiler, this is always an important bit for a car. Let's see, we've got this. They're a bit shoot, okay. I quite like those type ones. I like those type of wings. I like the ones that are like... I don't know, I call them C-shaped because they're kind of in the shape of a, she, a C. You got two lines and then a thing of me, so looks pretty good. Uh, what are we going with though? Stock smaller does look good, but I do quite like this one. Yeah, we'll go with the sports wing, it looks good. We'll buy our transmission, our turbo. 
what else wheels now this is always an important bit high-end chrome see guys i always use high-end chrome wheels call me a cheapskate but i have every set of wheels high-end chrome for free and i'm not wasting good money on a pair of wheels well technically it's a set of wheels it's more than two but i don't care so we got these ones i'm not really digging high-end chrome we're going with sports okay what sports wheels are we going for this is always an important bit. We always choose a pair of wheels that kind of go with the car, and usually I'm not really good at that, so I end up taking a pair that are just absolutely horrible. Do you know what I just realized? I just paid 6k for wheels. Wow, I don't care. We're going with Iron Chrome. They're all free. Alright, I actually don't know how I got Iron Chrome wheels, though, guys. <clears throat> to be honest with you, so if you want, you could also leave a comment down below telling me how I got them, because I have no bloody clue. Came on one day after an update, I have everything for free on them. Tire smoke, red. There we go. Right. Windows, limo. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the upgrade portion of this video, guys. Now I'm going to pretty much take it outside, drive it around for a bit, and pretty much give it a little test. We'll see how it rolls. I'm not sh I'm not too sure. Classic cars usually are a bit, bit iffy on turning. That's usually the thing. It's too skiddy, too much understeer. Make myself sound professional there. Like I know what I'm talking about. Right, here we go, out we come. Looks really good. Okay, I wanted to turn the lights off, it just so failed. Here we go, right. It looks sexy, I love this car. It's worth it, looks good. It's, it's, it's definitely a good showroom car if you want to impress your mates with it. <gasps> okay, look at this MLG Pro driving. I can do this. Oh, fuck. The turn off, sorry. LTJ, please go away. Right, here we go, continue, continue. Looks good, I'm loving it. Let's go with all the light hitting it. Right. I don't know how fast we can go in it. That's a good question. Probably do a drag race video for it later on today, guys. Try and get it up for you later on. Okay. We're going pretty quick. It seems to be handling okay, guys. It's not too shabby. It's just that back, but that's the same with like all the classic cars. Really, really skiddy back. It's annoying. Well, like all cars, it will take used to time to get used to. So we'll see, we'll see. It looks okay. Driving okay. Oh, 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 too close there. We'll drive in first person. See what it looks like in this. Looks pretty good. I like that stunt strip. Looks pretty good. It'll also help against people shooting in your car. They won't get you. Right up we come. Ah, whoops. Sorry, lady. We just had something hit. So we're going about a hundred miles an hour. So you can't say it's a slow car. It's faster than a Roosevelt. Is another classic car. It's just meow. Love the new tires. This thing looks so good, guys. So, guys, that is pretty much it for this video, guys. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more GTA 5 videos every now and then. Or if you want to leave a suggestion on what type of videos you'd like to do, you can also leave that down in the comments, and I'll see if I can do a few of the videos for you. So that's pretty much it, guys. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.